choice of cutter for this bronze medal match is Apure. Wasson was the silver medalist in Gaziantep in Turkey at the European Championships. Uh, it feels like better to perform in the beginning. So if, uh, if you are unfamiliar with the terms uh, of karate, the, the language used is Japanese and aka means red and ao means blue. Exactly. So, first up, Dilara Bosson, her choice of kata, Papuren, she's seated number six, Anandai and Kurarumpha, and Papuren in the round robin. So, Mohammed, can you tell us a little bit about Papuren and what we should be looking out for? Uh, well, Papuren is one of uh, the strongest uh, katas for the Shishoda style. Uh, you can see speed in the beginning, you can see like uh, the athletes perform in a very speed way in the beginning, they use uh, the advantage to show uh, speed and uh, power at the same time, so uh, this is the advantage of this kata for me. Uh, I guess like female they use it more than the male, uh, it looks maybe better on them, so uh, yeah, as I said, it's a very strong kata for the medal bots. And you mentioned earlier, didn't you, about the technical performance and the athletic performance. Can you just explain a little more about that, please? Uh, yeah, uh, the, the referees, they have like 70% on the technical performance, 30% on the athletic performance, uh, where you have to focus more on uh, your technique uh, and uh, all about the kata. So your athletic performance should also be uh, a very high level, but, uh, you know, when you have the... Uh, a good uh, doing a good job in your uh, technical performance which will give you more advantage so even though uh, you are uh, at the end of the match you are tied with your opponent so the referees will go back to see the technical performance so you always have to focus on that uh, because kata is effectively a technical discipline exactly and kata can be found in in, in a number of martial arts judo uh, aido and uh, but also outside of karate uh, or outside of the martial arts, kata can also be found in theatre in Japan and in ceremonies such as the child ceremony, the charo, the tea ceremony. So it's a, it's a very important part of the story of how karate, how karate has been passed down through the years, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. I agree with you. Kata is art, you know, so it's not just a performance you go inside to do. It's like uh, it makes you feel good. It makes you uh, feel strong at the same time. So uh, kata is something really special. It's the basics, the basic of karate, like even the kumite athletes. They all need to do kata to have a very good technique while they are doing the kumite. And your opinion of the performance from the Lara Bosson? Uh, amazing performance, actually. Uh, you can see a very good balance. You can see uh, strong techniques, uh, nice athletic performance. So, in my point of view, it's a very nice cut. So, there we have it. Shimizu Natsuki.